back to war. Back to the present. I feel my firstborn daughter, if I ever have a daughter, shall be named after her amazing grandmother. Can we ransom this man? I guess someone is willing to pay for him. For his worthless hide. As far as I'm concerned. There we go. 87%. Our allies are doing their job. Our flanks are a little bit unbalanced, it feels like. Auto balancing doesn't really do much, it seems. Because most is from my tribe. And it's a single unit. Alright, there we go. With one. It's nice to have this little piece of island here so we can just immediately drop our troops down without losing anything. Right. All right. Oh, oh yes, I see something that makes me very, very happy. Very happy indeed. Well, there's actually two things that make me really, really happy. Oh, it's a hard decision. In my studies of warfare, I've come to realize that the tactics on the battlefield is only part of the story. There are other disciplines of equal importance. So, ah, inspiring leader is amazing. That is just a great thing. Siege leader, just as much. And since he is a really good, really good commander as it is, I feel we're going to go for siege leader because he's going to lead our armies. Um... And eventually, maybe we still get Inspiring Leader as well. That would be absolutely perfect. Oops. What? Where did my option go? I was just able to declare war. Ah, oh, he's defending against heathens, which costs us... Weird. I distinctly... There it is. What the hell is going on? Okay, boy. Would you like to be... Can I offer you a visualization? Let's wait for him to be at peace. Maybe he would like to be our vassal without a... Well, no, well he doesn't. But... For once... We could try. We could at least... Try. Ah, I put them in the wrong thing. Let's try for diplomacy a little bit. And we could press this claim, which I believe we should because that way we make him happy. And he's about as old as us. Would be nice to have a long term ally here. So, what do you got? Nothing. <laughs> Let's have it then. You have this weird ally there. Who cares? Certainly not us. Not the Irish. Oh, look here. All of Ireland will descend upon the Scots, the Picts, whatever they might call themselves. It matters not. Right, let's send our armies. Actually, little lady. Oh no, she can replenish her troops. We're not gonna, we're not gonna call her. Not just now. And I have a little bit of respite. Righty then. The king leads the center, as well he should. Flanked by his most trusted commanders. Our ruler is unmarried. What? Did my betrothed just die? That is deeply unfortunate. Or not. Let's see who we got. Someone who's strong would be nice. 
and a little bit closer to our age. She's sturdy and strong. That just <laughs> sounds great. She's 23. She isn't bad. She's an unhanded rogue. She's not she's not absolutely great. That that is certain. She also doesn't bring us very much in, in terms of anything really. But she's since she's a little bit older than us. Her childbearing years will be a bit shorter, so let's go with her. We want someone who's strong. Well, we're not gonna go with her. We can't afford the prestige hit. Let's see, there's this Duchess, but she's way too young. Okay, let's go by rank and then by age. 16, that looks good. A Welsh woman. She's a giant. Which decreases fertility quite a bit. But... Fertility is offset, so it's... She might be a good gamble. She might be a very good gamble. Let's see who else is there. Ah, these are all too old. All too old, way too old. Way, way, way too old. Okay, let's have the giant Tess. Why not? Let's do it. Gives us another alliance, right off the start as well. So... Let's gain some prestige, we don't need the money currently. Thank you, my love. My dear. My queen. Let us venture south. Hey, by the way... Babe, how about you come help me with this thing? Nah, we're not gonna call her in. She has nothing. She has 26 troops. We are definitely going to take everything and everyone. Our allies are already sieging. Let's create some good sieges again. These two siege... Well, these three siege this. These two siege this. This guy goes siege this. I'm probably removing something up here, but I don't mind. Someone is going to go siege there, I'm sure. Maybe it might even be us. Ooh. Apparently, my steward has uncovered rumors of an exceedingly special artifact. Let us send him on search. Or we could send someone else on search. Let's send our steward. That's fine. It's not doing anything too important. Look at the siege going. It's just over so quick with the siege commander in it. We could send them a priceless work of art. Let's let's give him a fancy gift. Even though we don't need gold as such. We don't need to overspend either. Alright, let's show them what we think of their ideas there. Hint. It's not much. Oh, they gotten it in the head that it's a good idea to siege my stuff. Boy, are they wrong. Let's re-siege. Actually, there's just 12 defenders. We don't need to be coy. Let's siege this thing. Taking what the war is about always speeds up the war. <laughs> Who needs... Oh, you're my kinswoman. Can we do something with you? 
Well, yes and no. Mainly no, though. Let us have her be this, because it doesn't matter whatsoever. Who can we imprison? Just end the plot, man. Just don't... I have, I have different issues to deal with, okay? Really. There's, there's a bigger picture, and you're not seeing it. Which kind of makes sense, because it looked like he had something with his eye. Alright. How can I rely on my generals when their understanding of warfare is so lacking compared to my own? Yeah, let's let's go teach teach our bishop about this because he really needs to know. This is essential knowledge for any bishop. At least in my realm. As long as you put your boots under my war table, you will learn the great strategies that I devise. Because I pay the bills. I build the trebuchets. Okay. Good, there we go. This war is Done and done. Thank you. For offering me such a opportunity here. Send our boys home. We still need to deal with this guy. Who are you fighting? Why are you fighting everyone? Alright, our marshal has been taken out. Let's have it be this guy. He's not great, but he's very grateful. So, that's kind of good enough for us, isn't it? Have him train some troops. Always good to train some troops. Let's see, we don't care about you, boy. I wanted to check on my wife, really, because she has a weak claim on the Duchy of Manu. Maybe we can press her claim somehow. Not really. Oh, hello! Okay, so this is interesting. We can press her claim. A woman she who is our... vassal. Who has an heir. To claim Mercia. Now, we will have to do this quickly. We will very much have to do this quickly. We're going to do this immediately, actually. I don't even... We're not going to check on the military capabilities of Mercia because they're probably nil. So, this is interesting. So, by doing this, we very much are going... Hey, you can join this time. Your troops have kind of replenished. My wife, my lovely, beautiful wife, she may still have her troops sit a little bit and wait. Now, if we claim this, since it's a duchy, she's still going to be my vassal because I am a king. And dukes are below kings. So we will have to set up loads of sieges here so it goes quick because she's old. She might die any moment. Really. So what we're going to do is we're going to siege this personally, the capital. And then we're going to set up sieges around here. These guys siege this. These guys siege this. And these guys siege this. And Chief Eilbren can connect to me. Let's have it. As such. I doubt we need anyone hunting troops because... Yeah, what's it gonna do? Fighters? He's over there. Dealing with a rebellion. This must suck so much for him. He's just doing his thing. Actually, we might fight his rebellion for him. 
so he can stop it. The hunt for the room and artifact has begun to slow down. Stuart Indretach just informed me he has some valuable and promising leads, but to investigate them, the search must venture into distant, inhospitable lands. Needs more soldiers. Alright, let's give him some soldiers, decreasing our national levy size. And we shall go bless the people with our artifacts and things. All right, my father died, so we have inherited the High Chiefdom of Mead from him. Which we don't want. We don't want to hold this title. So we need to check out what is ours now, and who it actually belongs to. Because I believe there's a lot of stuff going on here that's not really... Good. But before we do the councillor thing and everything... Ah, oh, we can have our designated regent be... This guy, he loves us. We press this claim and everything. So let's check. We have this, the High Chiefdom of Mead is this area here. We own... This piece of it. We don't want to own this piece of it. How do you like us? Not much. How do you like us? Not much either. How do you like... Nobody likes us down here. So we're going to check in our court. Actually, we can do this a little bit quicker. We're going to search our court. And we want... Gender men. And we want them to be content. Because a content man... Is likely to be very nice to us. <laughs> but we also want someone who has an heir. Good. He's great. He's a, he's a commander of ours. He's really good too. So he shall be rewarded. With... Now I need to check. The Chiefdom of Myth. Including all the subtitles. Ah. Right, so have it. Now that he has it. We shall grant him another title. Which is the High Chiefdom of Myth. Including all the subtitles. So now we have a very nice... Content... Vassal over here Who is not a great chancellor, but also not the worst chancellor So we will Send him on a goodwill mission down here All right, so we're taking care of this now. We still have some counties over here This one What duchy is this? What duchy is this? It's this duchy. So, what we're gonna do is actually transfer all the vassalage over to this guy. Including... This guy leading troops. Now let's check a little bit. He has cancer, so he's not going to make it. He's paranoid and a lunatic. So... We're going to build a little bit of counterweight to this guy. So he actually gets this county over here. Which is the county of Kunachatak. This. You'll have it. And then we're going to transfer the vassalage to him. And he gets this kid. And he gets... Our guy over here, which I can't give to him. Oh, because he's already part of this. Alright. Great. Already, we're cleaning up at home a little bit. Because now I don't have to deal with so many counts. Instead, I have more dukes to deal with. So it's easier to keep them all under control, really. Let's keep on fighting our war. What happened here? Oh, these were the the men of my dad. So since he died, they transfer control to me, apparently. 
With my astounding knowledge in all matters of state and stewardship, it should not be too hard to sway King Morand into appreciating me more. Well, let's tell him of the prosperity of our realm, because what could go wrong talking about this from our perspective? Nothing is what? Nothing whatsoever. Alright, let's unpause this. Make sure that we are actually siege leader. Yes, we are. Let's place a new commander on the side here. Alright, he is actually impressed by what I wrote him. Listen to the music. Does that music not put you right in this... right in this world? Perfect. We've raised some warriors. Well, that's... That's not a few. It's quite a bunch of warriors there. Willing to fight for us. Oh, look at this! My sister has usurped the title from the guy I gave it to. <laughs> Which means I don't have a chancellor anymore. Because that was the guy. Meaning we can look for someone somewhere. Because I can't put her in the position anyway, sadly. Wish I could. Uh, let's have this gone away. And let's get the Impaler with a stutter to be our Chancellor. Why not? Nobody better suited for this. Okay, we need to make sure that he's not losing. Oh, yes, 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 yes. There we go. We're also now an inspiring leader. We need to make sure he doesn't lose against the... Against the uprising here. We need to take the uprising out and maybe give this at least one leader. Right, the Chancellor is there. So let's have him improve relationships here. What if we have a bunch of commanders on... Ah, only one. Oh, well. Give them another leader there. And uh, b -b 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 there was a few more minor titles unset. So let's go through them real quick. Cupbearer. Kid can be cupbearer. Bishop can be my seneschal or court tutor. Should be a genius. Generally give geniuses the court tutor role. Doesn't hurt. So we don't want to have this rebel uprising win anything. Because it might lead to... Well, damn. Speaking of it might lead to something. Losing to rebel army. That's That's embarrassing. It's not going to happen again, I tell you that. <laughs> Definitely not. Oh. Is this more rebels? 
I feel like we've lost a few allies here. Let's see. Let's call our wife in. Child like focus. We don't mind. We don't care. We don't care about you either. You become this. Alright. Send our armies down here. Because if this insurgency wins something. Then we are a little bit pressed for luck. Because the ruler might... Oh, yeah, 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 there we go. The ruler might change before we can do our thing. There we go. There we goddamn well go. Perfect. This is perfect. Now, she might be at war, actually, with someone. Where is she? Where is your capital? Missy? My chiefdom of Mercia. Oh, it's here. This. So we're going to... Can we offer to join a war? Nope. Cannot, in fact, offer to join a war. But... We can still help. We can still help. And I'll tell you how. In just a moment.